Hey guys, it's been a while since uh, I posted a tutorial after I, you know, because I put up uh, my song. I wanted to see how many views it would get after I put up a couple of tutorials. Um, so I'm not going to stop making tutorials, just to let you know. I'll always make tutorials because uh, I just want to, and it makes me better. Um, Alright, so today I'm going to teach you guys how to make a drop type synth. And it's like, uh, it's best used when you, uh, sidechain it to the kick of, uh, of the dubstep beat so it, like, drops and it, like, rises back up in volume so, you know, you really feel it and it hits hard. Uh, but this is the sound that I'm gonna teach you guys how to make. This is C4 right now. And this is C5. Alright, so uh, let's get into it. Oscillator 1 is a square saw and it's on spectrum. It's uh, minus 12 semitones, 1 octave down, wavetail position up, intensity up, amp up. Oscillator 2 is a hard sync, it's the first one under analog electric. Uh, down one octave, wavetable positions all the way to the left, intensities all the way to the right, it's a bend minus plus, everything's routed to filter one. Oscillator three is a crude, bend minus plus, down one octave, wavetable position all the way to the left, intensity all the way to the right, again, uh, filter one. Um, modulation oscillator, ring mod is on one. Phase is on two, positions on three, filters off, FM is off. Ring mod all the way up. Phase is about uh, ten o'clock. Positions all the way up and uh, filters not on. Um, it's down one octave, minus twelve. No noise, no feedback. Insert one's a hard clipper. Drive all the way up. Dry wet all the way down to the left, we're going to modulate that later. Insert 2 is a frequency shifter, right here. Pitch is the same, draw what's all the way down, we're going to modulate that too. So all the way to the left. You got to go into routing, right here where it says filter 1, make sure it's clicked on insert 1. And right here where this X is, make sure it's on insert 2, so you can actually hear this. Um, voicing, unisono is on 2, polyphonic, Pan positions like right about here before the M in mono. All right, no filter. Um, the EQ I just boosted the low and high a little bit. Dimension expand I left everything the same. Classic tube everything's the same. All right, um, I don't do anything on oscillator. Um, envelope one is uh, I just boosted the attack a bit to a. Uh, a little bit above nine. Actually, no. It's it's ten o'clock. The levels all the way up. Decays halfway. Levels second levels halfway. I didn't change anything else with the release. Just double click that to set it back to its uh, default. All right. So envelope one goes on oscillator one, two, and three, and modulation oscillators pitch, and it's going up one octave to twelve. Plus 12, and um, it's gonna be on the oscillator 2's wavetable position. So since the wavetable position is all the way to the left, you're gonna click, you're gonna put it on the box, and then you're gonna drag all the way up. And you're gonna do the same thing with the wavetable position of the crude oscillator 3. Just drag it all the way up on the wavetable position, and on the intensity of uh, oscillator 3, you're just gonna drag it all the way down since it's going to be on on the right um on insert one the clipper dry wets all the way to the left you're going to put the envelope so it goes drags all the way up and you're going to do the same with the frequency shifter on insert two you're going to drag it all the way up because it's all on the left don't mess with the pitch because then you'll get some uh weird sounds but uh yeah that's how it's this is what it should be sound like. I 
actually have a bunch of these made that's why I named this drop 2 um, I'll include this on uh, my Facebook page for download so all you gotta do is like and then you can uh, download um, what I do sometimes is to add some variety to the the base loop that I have usually this is the first uh, synth you hear but you know every every after every third bar I maybe add a, a little bit more vibrato so and one thing you can do is you can uh, modulate the attack but uh, yeah guys so, that's all I have for you today. Um, this is massive 1.3.0, so if you don't have that, then just you gotta have to watch the video to get the patch. But uh, other than that, you should be fine. Thanks, guys.